How does use state work in React? Well, let's look at an example. We have a component with a count and a button called increment. Right now, the count is static. If I press the button, nothing happens. Let's change that. First, we're going to import use state from React. We'll use that to create a new state variable where our dynamic count is going to live. Use state takes in an optional default value, which in our case is zero, and gives you back two things, a state variable and a function to update it. Let's replace the hard-coded zero with our new count variable. Visually, nothing has changed. It looks the same, but the count now comes from the state. If we want to update the count, all we have to do is add the setCount function to the buttons on click event listener. With this, whenever the button is clicked, setCount will update the count with a new value. In our case, the current count plus one. Use state can hold any type of value, strings, arrays, objects, and even functions. It's extremely useful and is used in virtually every React application. If you want to learn more about React, be sure to leave a follow.